Hey everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to do a pantry haul and also a fridge haul. Uh, my husband is redoing our cabinets. We're renovating and selling our home so I had to move a lot of stuff into this um, TV cabinet. So I'm just going to show you that first and then I'll move into the kitchen and then to the fridge. Okay, here's where I keep all of my unopened cans and jar items. I just have artichokes, um, it's a Thai, uh, Pad Thai sauce. We've got cocktail sauce. And this is a hoisin sauce. Olive oil, pumpkin can, two of them. Uh, this is a red wine vinegar. This is a blackberry ginger balsamic vinegar. Uh, I think this is a, this is a broth. It's a miso broth. And then this one is a beef bone broth. There's some rice. Uh, quinoa, extra quinoa there. Um, two jars of Alfredo sauce. And then we've got three jars of tomato sauce. Some extra ketchup there. Basil pesto. This is my favorite oil to cook with. 100% uh, pure avocado oil. Make sure you get the 100% pure in any type of oil that you buy. Uh, get tomato paste. Here's like my stir fry stuff, um, water chestnuts, bamboo shoots, baby corn, and stir fry vegetables. Got three cans of olives back here. Got some enchilada sauce, green chili, wicked original pickles, and just some sliced peaches. Coconut milk for probably a stir fry. And then just some diced green chilies to go with enchilada sauce. And then down here I just have a chicken, a chuck chicken breast, uh, like six cans of corn, quite a bit of tuna there. Uh, kidney beans, refried beans, and these go back a little ways. I like to keep stock on beans. Um, we got cannelli uh, beans, pinto beans, and black beans. All right, that's it for that. In here, I just have some of my silverware and things. And this is like a junk drawer. This is my spices. Uh, this is a red raspberry leaf tea that I drank when I was pregnant. I got this from Costco, and then the salt and the pepper from Costco some tea and just a bunch of different spices some raw and filtered honey and then coming up here just some squash thingies um different kinds of seasonings turkey gravy mix we got an original country gravy actually i didn't even realize i had that um brown gravy yeah, more brown gravy. I'm not going to go through this whole box, but I have a ton of brown rice, uh, polenta, um, some, oh, what do you call it, pancake mix, and this is, uh, what do you call it, muffin mix, uh, gnocchi, just some more rice, this, these seeds, I like the seeds to change rice, already made. Um, some more noodles and things. Other than that, um, I'm gonna go ahead and take this down and show you. This is our snack bin. All right, down here in the bottom, I have these Go Go Blast organic um, pouches. Actually, my my kids grew out of the pouch phase quite a bit, and I tried these from Costco, and they didn't like them either. So um, I'll probably end up eating them. This, uh, these are like five boxes of crackers I got from Costco. Uh, it's like a snack mix. These are from Costco as well. Bark Thins, 
dark chocolate pumpkin seed. And yeah, we got a pumpkin theme going here. These are also from Costco. Pumpkin spice. Ugh, I've been like really horrible lately with buying things like that because I don't usually buy things like that. Here's another one. Uh, these were like, these aren't bad though. They have um, no artificial coloring, flavoring, and no high fructose corn syrup. So, and the ingredients weren't bad on those, so I don't feel too bad about that. Um, got these cake cups for if we have ice cream. These were pretty good, and they have really good ingredients. Uh, no artificial colors or flavors. I got those at Walmart. And then we just have these bars. I think there's three different flavors of these in there. Uh, got those at Costco. My youngest loves those. Okay, that's it for the snack bin. Okay, here on the first shelf I just have some flour, baking powder, quick rice, yeast, uh, some ghee. Uh, this is coconut palm sugar. I like using that for cooking. Uh, some butter. These semi-sweet chocolate chips. Um, and then these are like, this is like some extra milk. Um, these are my smoothie stuff. I like to do a chocolate uh, banana and peanut butter smoothie and add this in. It's just a superfood blend. I got it at Walmart and it's really good. And then we've got, this also I like putting in um, smoothies, that uh, just like a fruit smoothie. It has fruits and vegetables and it tastes so good. Raw superfoods and antioxidants. Um, I got this at Walmart as well actually. It's got some good stuff in it and my kids will love it. It tastes so good. And it's just like a, a dark red color. It's hard to see. It smells good. I also like to throw the gla uh, ground flax seed in smoothies, and then I have this collagen peptides. Um, I don't really put this one so much in smoothies, but like soups and stuff. But yeah, you can put this as great for smoothies, so you can always do that too. Sorry, my fingernails are dirty because I was um, in my garden today and didn't get a chance to clean them out yet. Okay, so these are just some coffee filters, my coffee stuff some bread up here, sourdough, regular bread, Art artisano, I don't, extra onions, and then in here, I just have some onions and potatoes. All right, moving over onto the next shelf. I just have Adam's peanut butter. We've got some lobster biscuit mix. That looks really good. Cornbread. Annie's mac and cheese, some oatmeal, just some random stuff on the shelf, um, some popcorn. I don't like to buy any popcorn that isn't GMO because um, if popcorn is not GMO, usually it's, or if it's not marked non-GMO, then it's usually GMO. Okay, I just have like a load, like so much cereal. Oh my gosh. So I have just those chocolate loops. I have two bags of those. Got regular Cheerios. These are just a little chocolate. I don't know, pieces. Um, these are the shredded wheat with blueberry on top. And these are the uh, leap and lemurs. And then up here, I, oh my gosh, I have so much cereal. Is, um, I got this from Costco. It's just granola. Okay, down here, there's just some uh, fresh veggies and stuff, avocados. Um, the tomatoes are from my garden. And the peppers are from my garden. Also, here's my little um, pumpkin from my garden. Except, I planted a um, I planted a honeydew seed, and that's what I got. So interesting. Okay, that's it for my cupboards and things. And let's go into my fridge. All right, up here I just have half, some half and half um, grape jelly. This is grilled sweet peppers, um, sweet mango chutney, turn, 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 uh, banana, walnut butter, um, I got these from Costco, they're a probiotic, 
drink. You're supposed to drink one a day. Um, I love these. This yogurt also has probiotics in it. Um, the Nusa is our favorite. Some Hershey's um, chocolate. I like this one because it has five simple ingredients in it. Genuine chocolate flavor. No high fructose corn syrup. And that's... Um, <laughs> That's what I like to look for when I purchase food for my family, most of the time. Got some pasture-raised eggs. I got these little cups of guacamole from Costco so that uh, it doesn't go bad. Got some spinach, some lettuce hearts. This is a broccoli slaw. Some corn there. This is the salad mix from Costco. The Mediter Mediterranean Crunch Chopped Salad Kit. That one's the best in my opinion. Moving down, we've got some stocked up sour cream. Ricotta. I'm going to make a zucchini lasagna from the zucchini in my garden. Here's some salsa, kimchi, extra pizza sauce from when we made pizza the other day. Um, more pickles, tahini. I wanna make something out of that. Anybody have really good tahini recipes? Leave them below, please. Um, we got this big thing of garlic from Costco. That was also from Costco and I haven't tried it yet, but it looks really good. I have two of these. I have another one out in my freezer. These are just tortillas. Um, this is a uh, yicama, some more salad, more tortillas, um, what is this, that zucchini. I'm going to make a pot roast stew with this, uh, I think I might do that tomorrow, I might try to do that. And then just some Polish, Polish sausage. Down here we've got cabbage, leeks, celery hearts. The big thing of mushrooms from Costco, um, cauliflower, uh, just some zucchini and tomatoes, uh, grapes, uh, it's dirty down here a little bit, uh, kiwi, those things my kids didn't finish, lemons, um, snap peas, and some limes. Up here, just some cream cheese butter. I like to get the Tillamook cheese because it's just, it has um, better ingredients. Some easy drinks and different things up there. Uh, let's see, some of my favorite things and sauces is like this Coco Aminos. Um, we like to keep this on hand, Caesar dressing. Let's see. This stuff looks good and I haven't really tried it. Something. Couple different ones here, uh, Carolina style gold. You know, the, all the things you have on in the door of your fridge. I like to keep these on hand so I don't have to buy the the ones that come in the uh, containers, and it just lasts so much longer. And I always have it on hand. So, hot sauce and things. Yeah, that's pretty much it. Uh, I have a. F oh yeah, let me show you my freezer. Um, and I also have, I also have a freezer out in my garage, uh, with more food in it too. Um, there's that frozen bananas, um, f these are all fish. My husband went on a fishing trip, so fish, more tortillas, some mixed berries. These are, uh, English muffin, but they're the pumpkin spice kind. Orange juice, sausage. It's kind of a mess in here. I didn't really bother to clean this out. These little pancakes my children like. Um, these cinnamon rolls. These are my favorite cinnamon rolls. Annie's. I like the Annie's brand. Uh, organic cinnamon rolls. What else do we have? More frozen fruit, strawberries. Triple berry blend, uh, strawberries, mushrooms, these ribs, after. 
Uh, more chicken, sausage back there, and these are thick and fluffy power waffles. Uh, these are the square kind. Those are good. Such a, it's kind of dirty in here. Um, flatbread, just some frozen meals, more chicken, some random meat there, some random stuff down there. Okay, this is the freezer out in my garage. And we got some quiche. This came in a three pack. Oop. <laughs> this came in a three pack from Costco and everybody really likes this. There's the other tortillas. This is a Polish sausage. Also from Costco. Smart indulgent salmon deal. Um, some tofu. Some extra sourdough bread chopped like greens tofu uh, my husband my husband hunts so that's all of his um, that's everything we have left from last year some chicken these are cauliflower crust pizzas those are good the last thing is this wild cut argentine red shrimp thank you so much for hanging out with me today as I went through my cupboards and showed you my pantry and fridge tour.